Well, a wintry Vermont Sunday didn't stop both UVM lacrosse teams from taking the Virtue Field turf. And while we didn't have a full house for either game, the fans that did show up were treated to plenty of offense. We'll start with the women. They faced off at 11.30 against Fairley Dickinson, looking to leave their 0-3 start in the rearview mirror. And it only took one quarter for the Catamounts to gift the cold fans a running clock. 11 goals scored in the first. In the second, Vermont on the attack. The ball finds a stick of Maddie Erskine, and she wastes no time finding the twine. It's 13 to 1, Vermont. Another one for Erskine here. She comes into the frame, goes right to goal, and scores. In the second half now, look at this passing from the Catamounts. Quickly up the field, Jane Trauger finishes it off in front. UVM goalie Jackie Ship took over midway through the game and gets a save on the chance for FDU. With the pending blowout win, the Catamounts check into the game some of their younger players. And Lindsay Lefebvre cashes in her first career goal and her team is fired up. Lefebvre adds a second goal shortly after on a good snipe. Vermont beats Fairleigh Dickinson 21-3 and they pick up their first win. It was great to be back here on our home field in the environment that we love to play and the Cats love the snow. We're a team that we're building but we're always getting better and I think today coming out the first quarter being up by 10 was a great showing of who we really are and how we're just continuing to develop. The Catamounts will stay home and get ready for Fairfield on Saturday. Then it was the men's turn. Vermont trying to stay undefeated at home against a Brown Bears team that made the NCAA tournament last season. Right off the opening faceoff, Brown brings the ball into the zone. Pass goes behind the net to Devin McLean. He brings it out front, shoots, it's 1-0. 30 seconds later, McLean and the Bears strike again. A quick shot beats the goalie. Catamounts get some life thanks to David Klosterman surprising the goalie. He finds the net right here over the shoulder. 2-1, Brown still leads. And then the snowy fun begins. McLean gets a hat trick already. We're still in the first on that shot. Brown begins to pull away here, but why should anyone else besides McLean score? It's 6-2. Vermont looks to stop the bleeding, but Brown goalie Connor Turow comes up with a big save. He made 12 in the game. Try to track the ball here through the flakes. Brown tries for another. And are you kidding me? It's McLean again. He finished the game with nine goals. Between McLean, the rest of their stellar offense, and their goaltending, Brown overtook the Catamounts at Virtue Field with relative ease. The final 22 to 12. Vermont now heads on the road to play Harvard on Saturday. Well, it was cold, but it was fun. That's gonna do it for me from a snowy Virtue Field. Reporting for sports, I'm Taylor Viles.